undercard, the contender final at the Sydney Entertainment Centre, and he is 14 years the senior of his opponent tonight. The height and reach, once again, the advantage is to the 35-year-old from Campbelltown in southwest Sydney. On the scales, he weighs in the best part of 2.3 kilograms. The heavier as well. Heavyweight action on Nitro Boxing. Let's go to Rick Powell. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we're back with more Nitro Boxing for you. This one is set at heavyweight. Let's introduce our red corner fighter. Please welcome Scott Lewis. his blue corner opponent ladies and gentlemen let's give it up for Mustard Neiman scheduled four-round heavyweight bout coming up for you right now as we take you to the red corner and introduce to you a fighter from Campbelltown wearing the black shorts with white piping weighing in at 98.12 kilograms he's trained by Terry Devlin at the Southern Cross Boxing Club with five fights recorded and two win on his two wins on his card including a recent win over Carl Webb let's welcome Scott the animal, Lewis! And on my left, in the blue corner, stands a fighter who makes his professional debut with us tonight. He's journeyed up from the home of the Crows, Port Adelaide, in South Australia, and has been training out of Angelo Hyder's Nitro Gym on the Central Coast. Tipping the scales at 95.8 kilograms, Let's introduce you to a former three-time Australian Golden Gloves champion. Ladies and gentlemen, he's Master Neiman. <laughs> Anthony Shipley taking care of all this action in center ring. Let's go. Okay, listen to me, lads. Want a good clean bout? Obey my instructions at all times. Protect yourselves at all times. If you have a knockdown, go to the furthest neutral corner. That one there or the one behind me, OK? Watch your head clashes and low blows. Touch them up. Austin Neiman, AIS member, two-time Australian heavyweight champion, the youngest ever Australian heavyweight champion at 19 in the amateurs, fought the 209 World Championships in Milan, Italy. And the reason for him turning pro at such a tender age and prior to the Commonwealth Games or Olympics, well, it's widely regarded his style is not as well suited, I think you could probably say, to the amateurs as it is to the professionals. Hey, you're right, Andy, and, uh, you know, I've seen this kid come through the amateurs since he was a teenager, and uh, he's always had that same style. He's a good hooker, he's strong. He's the, you know, the main aspect that we're going to see, which will be over time, is how he handles the distance of things. 
Nice and compact in his stance. Low centre of gravity. He's built like a, a front row forward in rugby union. Oh, and he's tagged Lewis there with a left hand. It was a temple shot. Lewis felt it too in the opening exchanges of round number one. I think, you know, Moston's just not got to get it. Uh, just, you know, don't get overawed. Just stick to the things. I think the punches are going to come. Take your time. Keep your defence well. Oh. Lewis is a big, strong, tough unit, mate. No mistake about that. Mightn't always look pretty inside the ring. The big, tough fella. Good fella, too. Scotty Lewis, the animal. Ooh, nice right hand from Moston Neiman. Good body shot. Look at Neiman. Go to work. Moss the boss, as he was known in the AMS. Self-proclaimed, I must add. Ha <laughs> ha. That's a little short left, just pushing Lewis and keeping him at distance. Just behind the ear, you can see Moston Neiman behind the right ear. He's got a bit of a, you know, red whelping, and that's where Scott Lewis keeps sending that hand, that punch. Beautiful body shots, and Lewis is hurting as a result. The hands drop to protect the midsection, and Moston goes high. He's in trouble, Scott Lewis. Oh! What about that? That punch would have rocked your granny. Moston Neiman. Just over 60 seconds oh. remaining, and Lewis is tagged. The counter point for the second time in a half minute. He missed the call of the body, went straight for the head. Didn't miss it either. Oh, he got tagged himself. Neiman looking to finish this with a first round stoppage. Three knockdowns in any one rule means an automatic finish to the fight. That is exactly what he is aiming for here. Going to the body, now searching up high. Scott Lewis, can he hold on for the remainder of this opening round? Oh, no, great he shot. can't. What a shot. What a victory. And on debut, Moston Neiman does it in style. For me, my favourite way to see a boxer get out of the ring is from winning on a body shot. I love seeing it. Perfect left rip. Well done to Moston Neiman. How impressive. Angelo Heiner has got huge wraps on this youngster. Now we know why. Very happy in the corner of the in the blue corner and rightly so. Congratulations to the whole team. Great win from Boston Neiman. Scotty Lewis. A wry smile there and sucking the big ones in. Not, ha not happy with how it happened or why it happened. He'll be back. Scott Lewis, mate, no mistake about that. Let's take a look at knockdown number one. Oh. Ooh. That'll break a rear ball four. Something like that. On both sides. There's the second knockdown. And the third was really more than just the one shot because he'd worn him down, he'd worn him down, and that was the end of it. That was the best one of the lot. Look at that right up under there. You cannot train for that. He'll wake up a 